Hey, what's up? It's Cameron I3, and I'm here to show you all my prop I made. Uh, it's pretty cool. I've been working on it for a couple days now. Um, but uh, let me get straight to it. My morpher. Why is it Dragon Coin? Because I like Green Ranger and stuff, so that's why I choose the Dragon Coin. But anyways, it's a solid, solid uh, morpher. Um, it's actually made out of cardstock, then I paper mache it and painted it myself. Uh, of course, the colors are off a little bit, but oh well. Uh, I do have a handle on it. Uh, I had to refix this back piece with cardboard because uh, the I don't know what happened. Like the paper mache just went, just fell right off. I don't know why. But I had to replace it. Um, before I replaced it, I actually put something inside the uh, morpher. Which is pretty cool, I think. Which is a LEDs. <laughs> yeah. Um, it lights up, and I'm very happy with it. Press the little button right here that's on the side, and voila, it lights up. Um, it's powered by four like extremely tiny uh, uh, cell batteries, button cell batteries. Uh, the button is a pressure switch really see how it's dimming in and out yeah but that's why I call it a pressure switch because you can put uh, as much as pressure you want on it and less pressure and stuff um, now I'm going to tell you the stuff I use to make this uh, of course, uh, the LEDs are actually from a LED flashlight. That's a small LED flashlight you can get at a gas station. Uh, the morpher, cardstock, uh, paper mache, so on and so forth. Uh, the handle is actually from a glass chest set. Um, so I just took off the handle from glass chest set and I put it on here. Uh, the switch itself, I actually had to find it in my house. So I took some things apart and I found this so I used it in it so I'm using it uh, like I said I have four buttons of batteries inside uh, now the uh, coin which isn't really a coin you can see this is actually a, um, a cap for a bank a little piggy bank but it's not really a piggy bank uh, you'll find this bank at Dollar Tree actually it's a Naruto piggy bank uh, what I did was cut off the uh, excess uh, plastic that was on the coin or the uh, cap and I just glued on the coin um, everything else is pretty easy of course um, it does not have the letters yet as you can see all it does is lights up the coin pretty nicely I like it so I can always go it's morphing time Dragon Zord, so on and so forth. Uh, but I love Power Rangers; it's great. Uh, please comment on that and rate or stuff. I don't care. <laughs> but if you want me to show you how to make it, it's very easy. Uh, but I got some questions to some people. Uh, the 93 or 94 uh, of the Saba, talking Saba from the White Ranger. Um, now I have one and I put in batteries and all that it's just not working I don't know if there's uh, some pieces inside of it's missing uh, because when I looked in there uh, there were some like empty holes that should been have something on them to be soldered with so there's some I think I believe there's some pieces missing uh, I don't know how to repair it that's why I'm hoping you all can tell me how to repair it the only thing I repaired it on is the uh, mouth moving on the t uh, tiger but if y'all can help me with that it's great awesome thank you um, that's pretty much it I will have a video of showing all my old Power Rangers collection instead of the 2010 collection uh, so please stay tuned for that and uh, so I hope you enjoyed this little video and I will see y'all later